can make you to break the heart of God, then it's fulfilled already. Satan is fulfilled when a child of God breaks the heart of God. Very, very important. The spirit realm is as the realm that is not visible to the natural sight, but it is real. Number two, the realm of the spirit is also a realm where human spirit connect to the reality of spirit forces, either divine or demonic. There are things God is doing in the spirit and there are things Satan is doing in what? In the spirit. But what the scripture says is that what eyes have not seen, what ears have not heard, what has not entered into the heart of man, as the Lord prepare for them that what? But you must also understand there are some things Satan prepares for you this week. You don't know. One of the things Satan prepares for you this week is that you'll be stranded. And if you will have his way, you may be stranded if you don't pray. One of the things Satan has in mind for you today is to turn your helper against you. And if you don't exercise influence and authority over that area, that is exactly what will happen. Just as God plans for you, Satan also what plans for you. The factory where they make their plans, where spirit makes plans for or against human being is called the spirit realm. What does it call? The spirit realm. You are not in your permanent form. You are still what? Growing. Yes or no? Because the realm where we are is a realm that processes growth. In the spirit realm, things don't grow. Things remain the same. That is why Hebrew 13 verse 8 said, Jesus is the same yesterday, today, and forever. The realm where God lives, the realm where spirit forces exist, either divine or demonic, they do not grow and they don't subject to change. Because some people is aware that something is wrong, Satan has taken a long miles in their life. Why? Because they couldn't discern the activities of evil spirits. That is the ignorance that is going on in the body of Christ. That is why we have a spirit of entertainment in the church to make people lose contact with reality. The natural realm where you are cannot solve your natural problem. And I told you that the realm of the spirit is a realm that is not visible to your natural sight except God brings you to that realm so that you can relate with authority.